I can save this! Please kill it! I don't- No! I don't even know how that works. If I would've like actually hypothetically got a drop there, what if it just been gone forever? I would've cried. Oh! That baited the shit out of- Wait, 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 wait. How did I just get a collection log from that? I literally know for a fact that I have Awakener's orbs in my bank. Or does every single individual boss give you a pop-up for that? I mean, it must. That's really- it's the same item, though. That's very strange. Okay, well... There is our first of probably very many Awakener's orbs. Thanks, Vardorvis. Ah, the you stupid Virtus Robotum in the CC right as I got my kill. Uh, if only. That would be my ideal drop, considering I don't have the Ancestral Pants. If I could pull Virtus Robotums first, that would be so ideal. I don't even want to say this out loud, because I'm definitely going to jinx myself, but... I have noticed a, a difference between me killing this boss between yesterday and today. Certainly getting the hang of it. Why? Why, why, do, why do I even speak? Literally, just shut your mouth, bro. I thought I saw the head pop up, so I prayed range. Why do I even speak, man? Okay, that's it. <laughs> I've got four rings of shadow in my inventory. I'm banking them, man. We are- we are down bad. I misclicked! No! <laughs> there it goes. It's in the bin. I'm gonna die now. It's literally all come un unglued. <laughs> we're off the fucking rails now. Hey, we're, we're rewarded for our horrible kill. We take those, thank you. Alright, here we go. We, uh, we're gonna try the combat achievement task in which you have to stay within the middle 5x5 five five, and you can't kill it until at least 3 minutes have passed. So basically, I just gotta hang out in the middle here and, uh, not die, so. Nah, I- Immediate- I- I immediately left the tiles. <laughs> Immediately! Shit! <laughs> oh no. Oh no, 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 I'm having a bad time, bro. Okay, let me, let me get my health up here, alright? Let's, let's get the health up, and then we start focusing here. At the very least, I gotta get these prey ranges correct. It's been like 30 seconds, bruv. I'm fighting for my fucking life out here. Just don't die now. Alright. The justy was the move. Axe enthusiast. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do a couple of birdhouse runs to make up for that task. Good lord. Ooh, baby. Uh, I got 60 Onyx Bolts earlier today, but apparently I didn't take any damage that kill, so I got 50% more, so 90 Onyx Bolts? Holy. That's a good drop. I'm always down for a fun little challenge, especially if I'm getting paid to do it. I was, uh, gifted five subs to do a kill in full Darox, and, uh, man, it went a lot better than I thought it was gonna. Oh, 81? Okay. The Darox is the move. <laughs> 80! I just maxed already! <laughs> okay. Panic my Darox. 86! <laughs> what the fuck? I'm slapping him! 83! Bro! <laughs> What? I'm actually slapping so hard. 61? This is incredible. 40. <laughs> Dude, I should have stopped eating. I could I could have got the grandmaster time if I would have just like not ate and just like fucking ate it. The damage that is. 
What's the time on that? 119? Dude, I, I'm doing another kill. What? You're almost at the finish. I every time. I mean, I, I want to leave the orange beam because it gives me at least a, a trickling of dopamine, but it also baits me like crazy every time, man. Every time. If I can hit big here, this might be a PB. Ah, that felt pretty fast. <gasps> 55? No! It has to be sub 55, doesn't it? I missed it by one second? Just without even trying? No! I missed it by one game tick. Oh, I'm actually upset. What? I'm actually so upset. I didn't even try and we was right there. Oh. <laughs> no way. Oh. The good news is that means if I just continue to grind this boss, I could probably get it done eventually, just naturally. Is he pressing down the alt key or something? I can't click. I cannot click. I cannot click. I cannot click on anything. He, he, he. Carrots, what, what, carrots, what did you press? What have you done? I, I can't, I. All I can do is move it. What the fuck? Could you imagine if that just happened on the fucking farmers? Oh my god. Okay, uh, that's my first, like, full stream session of Vardorvis. Despite dying, per my estimations, about 15 times today, costing me 3 million in deaths, uh, I did get 124 kills today. So, if the drop rate of the Vestige is a little over 1 out of 1k, you know, realistically, we're looking at less than 10 days to grind out the Vestige. That's really not bad at all. Hey, grats on your Virtus Robe Top. Fuck you. I actually learned last night a really good tip on completing the Whisperer speedrun. You just uh, hit harder. So, <laughs> I would just do that. See, I've been doing that for hours, man. It's not going my way. <laughs> Did you I think, think about maybe using the best gear in the game and also having max range for a mage boss? Yep. I saw a funny joke like that on Twitter. You know the old uh, cartoon, Max and Ruby? I love that. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I get it. I love that show. You know, I, I kind of like that there's that RNG variant to it. Because, like, I mean, obviously it sucks that you have to rely on resetting until you get the rubies. But you need to be good enough that once you finally get the rubies, you can take advantage of it and still get the kill. So there's a level yeah. of skill there that, that it plays towards still. I mean, that is true. Yeah. You can get the luck, but you still have to do the little things right, right to make it happen. Right. Feeling good about today, man? No! That made me feel immediately worse! <laughs> Bait. Bait. It's it's better than nothing. It's fine. It's, okay. it's good. I'm happy. I mean, that's actually a good point. Yeah, I've, I've never attempted any of the Awakened bosses, and I would like to get Blood Torva on this account, so... It kind of goes without saying, I'm going to need a lot of orbs, so the more the merrier, really. Oh, d we are orbin today. We're, we're, we're not morbin, it's, it's orbin time. It's my third one already. I will commit to the kill. I am regretful. I have a shark in my inventory, but didn't need it. What is this fucking Bodhi in the Gillinor games? Why didn't I eat my shark? Oh, Scythe, I love you. Woo! Dread, we're awarded 150 Dragon Dart tips. Oh, that's what it's all about, baby. That's what it's all about. Orbin! O R B! Orb, orb, orb! Hey, a collection log slot. I was wondering when we were going to see that. There is the Blood Quartz. Of course, the, uh, the quartzes are the, uh, little things you put into your ancient scepter and it gives it a buff. I think the drop rate on that is like 1 out of 200, so definitely did go way over the drop rate for that. Uh, although I don't remember exactly what the blood scepter does. I'm gonna look that up quick. Okay, so if you have a blood scepter, it can heal you to 10% over your max HP. So, that's kind of niche, but not bad either. Could be nice for dangerous waves of the inferno or something 
Now the question is, is do I have a ancient scepter to put this blood quartz into? I have a shadow and a smoke. Oh boy. I don't. And in order to get an ancient staff, I'm gonna have to kill... Vedion? I guess? I don't know. I mean, I've got the icon, but no staff to put it on, so... A uh, quick Vedion detour, I think. Hmm. Well... It's supposed to be... There is actually no way... My first fucking kill. There's no way. <laughs> it's just that easy, bro. I... I actually was looking forward to killing a little Calvarion, so do you know what? I'm not leaving yet! I... What, one kill... Okay, okay, dude. All right. I gotta try to go for revenge. Holy damage. Holy damage! Jesus! We did not bank the staff, so, uh... Guess who's killing more Calvarion? I'm gonna go dry on this one now. What? Good fight. <clears throat> Thank you. <laughs> Yippee! 2.8 mil? Yup. Yup. Definitely gonna drop that to my main. 50k was from me, obviously, and the other key is 2.8 mil, dragon crossbow, swamp bark, and some goodies. Alright, there we go. 84 kill count. Well, so, I guess on today's loot tracker, I've killed 31 Calvarion, so... Took me 30 kills to get the second ancient staff. That wasn't too bad. Okay, so you take one of these, use it on one of the... What do you mean nothing interesting happens? I gotta take it to Eblis. God damn it. And we slap the blood quartz in there. Yes, I would like you to actually do it. And now I will wield it for one time and one time only. Now it will go live in my bank for the rest of its life. What? Wait, 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 wait a minute. So I just went and did that whole ordeal to get an ancient staff to put the blood quartz in. And then I do a clue scroll, and then I come back, and my very first kill back, I get another blo- What the hell? Ah, <laughs> huh? That's bizarre. Okay. Medium clue scroll. I do find it very bizarre that they made it so all of the DT2 bosses can drop any of the clues. Feels very strange getting a medium clue from a level 784 boss. Wait, yeah, you know, they heard me. They were like, oh, you, you don't like, uh, you don't like medium clues? Hey, too good for medium clues? Here, have a stupid elite. Damn, we're getting all the clue scrolls tonight. Vardorvis is gonna single-handedly fund a master clue at this rate. And I'm gonna get fuck all from it. But, you know, that's okay. Nar. 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 Nar! I still have three Vardorvis CAs. There is five perfect kills in a row, which I still haven't done, because I'm a shitter. There is an awakened Vardorvis kill, which again, haven't done, because bad. And there's a sub-55 Grandmaster time, which I have not really actually tried for. And there is Blood Quartz number three. So we went way over the drop rate for our first Blood Quartz, and uh, <laughs> now it appears we're making up for it. Captain goes down with the ship! Captain goes down with the ship! Yes! Oh, that would be the best time to get a drop, man. <laughs> that would have been perfect. Sunday. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Stupid fucking tentacle on the floor, man. Hey guys, I'm here with my best friend, Virgin Boobs. Say hi, Virgin Boobs. <laughs> Jesus. Perfect Vardorvis yet? Nope, but I'm gonna do it right now. That was kill number one right there. We're just... This is the trip. I'm just gonna, you know, put my mind to it, get her done.
We've done it. We've done it! Finally! 530 Vardorvis kills later! We've done perfect Vardorvis. That is, uh, five perfect kills in a row in the same trip. You know, the I, 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 I literally said, I was like, I just, I just gotta mentally, I just gotta turn it on, you know? You just gotta, you just flip the switch, man. You just, just lock in, time to get her done. There we go. Oh, we are rewarded on kill number 555 with 300 raw sharks. That's sad. 555 kill count with uh, still no drops to show for it. The thing is, though, I don't even think I'm at the drop rate, so it's really not even sad. It just stays what it is. Well, I'm pretty sure it's like 1 out of 1k for the Vestige. I think it's 1 out of 1k for any Virtus piece. And it's 1 out of 1k for an Axe piece. So if you were to combine all that, surely it's about 1 out of 300 something to get any of the above, I guess. Hold on. No, don't you do it again. It's supposed to be like ammonia. <laughs> oh, yeah. Jordan. It smells like a cat just pissed in my head. Oh, <laughs> holy shit. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> That's intense. Oh Holy, let's go for Dorvis! That's actually intense, bro. Holy shit! Oh my god! That's insane. That is insane. Oh my god! That's insane. People just hit. I mean, I yeah, I can see it working. <laughs> you feel alive? Yeah. It uh. <laughs> It, uh, it wakes you up, man. Follower duration one. Oh my god. Shit. What did I- Where is my infernal cape? What the hell am I wearing? Oh, this is- Oh, no. It's all falling- Oh, god. It's all coming unglued. Oh, baby. We gotta drop. It's- not the Ultor, but I'll take that. Executioner's Axe Head. Ooh. So, the Executioner's Axe Head, of course, is Vardorvis' piece of the, uh, the Soul Reaper Axe, which, you know, the sad thing is, as far as I am aware, if you have a scythe, you don't really use the Soul Reaper for, like, anything <laughs> over, the, over the scythe, but it is a really cool weapon, and I would like to get it. And frankly, I'm happy, because... Once I get the Altor, I'm probably never killing this thing again. So, getting the axe piece before the ring is honestly very ideal. So, I'm happy. Good. Good, 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 good. That was uh, kill number 640. 640 KC, and we finally have something from Vardorvis.